um, go and see work, right? The matters itself, right? Um, in fact, we found that there's many searches pertaining to gold prices uh, in the market, uh, like in the Google search itself. And we're very curious, how do, you know, how do they Google search and then be able to know about gold prices? And since Cal, you know, from Trade with the Boys is um, so-called the expert that they have the system that's probably able to track the gold prices or in fact even the silver prices that um, that we can really benefit, you know, as traders we can really benefit from it. So perhaps we want to seek the suggestion of uh, Cal. Alright guys, this is Cal here. Uh, well, you can see that right, in 2011 we saw the gold price went all the way up. All right, from I think $1,200 to all the way to $1,900. Now, back then when I was in Indonesia, I was telling friends of mine who said that to buy gold when it's $1,000, $2,000, $3,000. Oh. And I was being interviewed on the, um, the, by the journalist from business, uh, the business side asking me what's my view. And that time itself, I did mention that gold will go to $1,350. Mm. Now, but at the time itself, in human history, no one has seen gold at 1350 Yeah. No one saw it, but I gave the target. So when I was giving the first round, the, the, the journalist was like pretty shocked. Mm. And of course, a couple of weeks later, gold really hit 1350 Wow. Okay. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I'll give a secret to you later okay. on how I did okay. that. But more important thing is that I was asked again, right, this time around, more journalists came in and they asked to was all the all the senior journalists came in and asked let's have another interview with me and I tell them say that okay let's talk about gold again mm. and this time around gold was trading about 1400 now do not understand this that is the historical eye of okay. all humans have seen before then when I was there I gave four numbers four numbers okay and these four numbers I purposely say in Bahasa Indonesia Satu lapan lima kosong. Okay, those who understood bahasa. <laughs> <laughs> now that is one eight five zero. So when I say that, it's uh, imagine that what eight business, senior business correspondents mm. they were like looking at me for one moment and they kept laughing. Mm. They kept laughing away. They just couldn't stop. Mm. And they were like, "Are you sure, Mr. Han? You know things like that." I said, "Yeah." Then they ask for reasons. So I give the reasons, huh? Mm. Because number one is so, right, gold is definitely gonna go higher back then. Because the Bank Federal Reserve wanted to flood the market with the dollar, which it did that. Mm. Okay? Because they know that the economy is not going anywhere and the market just recovered from the Lehman Brothers time. Oh, so okay. in order to recover, they need to pump in more dollar and yeah. unfortunately it's so, there will be a cost for everything. Yeah. Okay, so what happened is that you can see so that you can see that more and more people go on Google, they search can we buy gold and more people asking around say that should we buy gold and dump away the currency and at the time Indonesia itself is packed with the US dollar, right? Yeah. So definitely the people are getting very uh, worried. Mm. And of course we are traditionally like the Indians and the Chinese, they like to have their own gold for yes. safekeeping. So with all this reason itself, right, we realize that that is where the opportunity is. And uh, of course, through some mathematics, I created that I believe that gold will go up to about one in five zero. So I told them, the, the guys just continue right. So when they wrote it, it's like my name was everywhere, and everybody was just shocked that this guy from Singapore is giving a number that no one has seen before. Wow. Okay. Okay. So obviously, when gold hit one in five zero, it was like a good call. Right, but the right. question is this: when you go to one nine zero zero, people right. ask me, so what is the next level? Okay. And this is where I come out with something. I told them, say, look, 1900 is a good price to take profit. Mm. Because back then itself, a lot of these people looking at 1, 2000, 2003, 2005, some of the well known hedge fund manager were saying it could go to 4000, 5000. Okay. okay? So imagine the time of whereby gold was going crazy. I remember in Singapore, there were one stage whereby everybody was running to a shopping mall and just go to any jewelry shop and just buy anything that do with gold in the market. Yeah. You realize that silver was not touched. Gold, all the ornaments were all gone. Mm -hmm. Alright, that was back then itself. So. And that is where by when you get this out of euphoric, that is where you have to exit from the market. Sure. Yeah, so that is the thing that where I tell people to get out of gold. I say no thousand nine, you might get out. And uh, of course back then many people didn't like this call and what happened? We all know that gold plunged 
from 1,900 all the way down to 900. To 900? To 900. Oh my god. Yes, that means that those who bought gold at 1,009, they are still probably still holding the gold at 1,009 level. So now we fast forward the tape. Now it's very 10 years. And this market really goes in a very cyclical pattern. So okay. that was 2011. So 10 years later itself is 2021. And here we are in the same position right now. People are asking, googling on gold. People are asking, looking at where to buy more gold. US Federal Reserve now have pumped in seven point six trillion dollars in the system. Mm. So obviously, itself the direction is pretty clear. There's no other way out. So with that, all this reason, the secret is out the back. Basically, means gold to go higher. And I believe that this time around, gold will see much higher level. Mm. So the last high was two zero seven four for gold around there. I believe that this time around we will see gold trading at 2218 minimally to maybe even 2350 around there. Wow, okay. Yes, indeed. Wow, you're quite specific. Yes, indeed. Because it's all a mathematics formula that okay. we created. And of course, since then, it's all been tracking gold for quite a while, I put this way. Mm. Um, I'm not a gold bug by per se, but I'm actually a gold fanatic. Which means okay. that, right, when it comes to gold itself, it gets me excited. Who do not who get excited, right? Because we must understand that the buying purchasing power of US dollar is definitely declining. Yes. Right, since the start of the uh, time of 1920s to today, after Richard Kathleen Nixon have actually got this gold off the back of the US dollar, we can see that it just came on going down. And of course, with now current situation, mm. whereby they have to print relentlessly. Yes. Yeah, you see that? So it is going to be very clear, like, I'll put it this way. But right? people will start to shift their funds towards gold. And I think this time around, silver will also come together. Oh, okay. Yes, it did. But uh, very much is more of a trading you're looking into that we can just buy and sell, mm -hmm. you know, this uh, paper gold or paper silver mm -hmm. and probably cash out quickly and. Uh, <laughs> Something, something towards that direction. Yeah, correct, indeed, right. For myself, we created this thing called the TWB system, right. This system basically allows traders to buy and sell. So we have a community of about nearly five hundred and fifty of us. We have been uh, tracking the gold market very religiously in this way, and uh, almost every day from morning seven a.m. we are online buying, selling, trading gold because we we believe that like, that is what we should do to combat inflation. But since that we do not have any chance to increase our pay, <laughs> all right? Because you look at this, what happened now? Commodity prices like food prices have increased by thirty percent over yeah. the last one whole year. But I'm sure my pay didn't increase by thirty percent. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah. So the thing is that if our pay didn't increase by thirty percent, but inflation increased by thirty percent, then obviously we have to make more money. So rather than buy stocks right now, they're kind of expensive, overvalued, and the dollar is a bit uh, looming crisis then the only way is that we trade more gold. And that's what we actually uh, explain this to our friends and relatives and even students, and they all buy it. They know that this is the right way, and that's what we're doing today. Wow, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. So you're going to share with us soon on uh, um, what would be the profit taking point that, you know, based on the targeted price that you have actually. Uh, okay, so basically what happened is that I created an indicator Right, this indicator is called KCX indicator, and this indicator works very well with gold. Okay. In fact, itself is really the, it's created for gold, and uh, we have proven to people and that if someone just follow this indicator, they should be able to make uh, this uh, buying gold rather consistently. So, the result is about between seventy eight percent to about eighty two percent accuracy, and uh, day to day we should have about two to three trades. Yes, mm -hmm. two to three trades. So, if people were to really want to uh, consider to increase uh, their wealth, then they should actually consider to try out this indicator of ours. I see, okay. Mm. This indicator sounds pretty powerful, so you can actually track the prices like even with that 70-80% accuracy. Yeah, it did. So, it yeah, did, it did. Right. All right. That's, that's what gave you that power of vision of the pricing on, on, on the gold aspect as well. Yeah, indeed. The, once we have this indicator on hand, you can actually realize that the um, you know, because traditionally when price goes up, people get worried, they say it's yeah. too high now, they don't get to go in. But for us as well, right, that is where we have to follow the momentum. Now, of course, I may be wrong in the target level, but as long as we are in the same direction, this way on the way up itself, every pullback for gold now, right, is a buying opportunity. I see, okay. Yes, okay. Yes. Okay. 
okay? Just now you mentioned that you have 500 over um, so-called fans that's like been trading gold mm. since early morning, uh, the first thing that they wake up, mm. you know, whether they didn't brush their teeth and it's straight and go to the market <laughs> and surprised. check out your indicator okay. and, and check the latest price to see whether you should buy and sell. Mm. So this, this um, how have you accumulated so many you know, fans over the over a short period of time or what? So okay. Yeah, to be really coming together. Mm. Um, does it make any sense to really come together so many of them? Mm. To, to look into, you know, go prices together and trade collectively or why not why not you just, you know, individually yeah, look at the pricing, you know, or Google search the price and then just okay. decide whether to go to go buy or sell at a point. Uh, let me give you this example. Uh, this is a good question as well. It's like, um, let's put it this way, okay? Uh, if we remember, right, we remember, like, say, uh, early, uh, well, last year, okay, when we have the unfortunate incident whereby the USA uh, army, right, they went to uh, Middle East and then they bombed and unfortunately killed one of the generals, then the gold prices go crazy. If all the media all calling to spy gold and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah, that was whereby our indicator shows something different. Yeah. Our indicator shows that, right, yeah, it's a buy, but there's something wrong with this whole equation. The sellers are actually more than the buyers, and this is only able to be sourced out via our system. So from there it started, right, we begin to warn people say that even though now the mainstream media is calling for buying, and you know, because this potential war coming in and stuff like that, we say no, it's time to get out. So truth be told itself, what happened after the market went up, gold price collapsed. And it's been going down for the last four or five months. Okay? okay. Then what happened is that last month, last month, when gold price was below 1700 that was whereby everybody telling me, Cal, you see that gold has came off. Alright, I think we should just sell or go away and go into something else. We tell our students that look, something has changed. Okay, the buying signals, the buying volume, the buying uh, setup have came in. So we say that no, it's time to go go. And of course, again, we have a lot of people say, Are you sure? and stuff like that. I say, very simple, we just trade every day and you will know. And truth be told, now, right, our go community are doing much better mm -hmm. than the other sectors, put it this way. I see, okay. Yes, so if you're asking me why they will come together, because they realize that we do have a very unique system that really works and I'm quite sure people will compare my system with other people's system and when you compare and contrast let's put it this way if our system doesn't work then they wouldn't be staying there with us mm -hmm. because our community is just in a telegram and anybody is free to exit but what happened is that they rather pay right at a fee of $96 per month to get the indicator and stay on and from, as I said, early in the morning, they're already there waiting to be like, you know, looking for my uh, market analysis and then they will trade until as late as 12 midnight. Wow. So if this system doesn't work itself, I don't think any any people will want to stay on and uh, continue this. Just uh, curious, uh, so with that, um, how much per day that, you know, your fans can, can actually make out of their... Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's a very, very sensitive, yeah, sensitive right. question, but, but I, yeah. I can tell you this is very quite unique here. I have people that make regularly between like fifty to hundred dollars a day. Okay, that's very, that's very Fair normal. Enough. Fair enough, right? But I have also incredible people, oh, incredible. incredible people that mix between ten to twelve thousand a day. You sure? Yes, and then, this morning itself. I, in fact, this morning I was a lady. Alright, I won't quote her name. She's known to be the happy dragon. <laughs> okay, we all know that okay. in our community. And she just went in today trading gold ten thousand US dollars. Wow. Just a single day itself. And of course we have even phenomenal people who makes hundreds of thousands of dollars trading gold. Wow, okay, okay. So the thing is that these people are not fake because they actually show their trades online. And um, of course no one will want to show demo trading account. People show real account right. and they are there physically to explain that why they buy and they all validated saying that it's because the system works. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So in fact, I will just say that right, it's just a matter of time. I believe now today, uh, we're going to see more buyer, more trade on gold very, very soon. Once the market capture that, okay, it's time to go into gold, especially if you go across 2000, I think that is where you will see mainstream media, everybody around you will be buying gold and stuff like that.
Yes. That's, I, I foresee that that will happen very soon. Wow, I see. Mm. But I think the value add that uh, you brought up is um, very much is that we better kept you know, quite close to you so that you know, we know, we actually knew that for that day itself, we should be you know, targeting to make how much percentage from our you know, trading, trading in the gold market as even if it's escalating up. Like, but there could be certain news that's driven to you know disturb the market that mm. that yeah correct. correct. So I suppose the value of this your fans group is mm. like at least um, they are kept in the loop very much of that. Okay, I'll like, put it yeah. this way, I think that uh, this is how I do it. I I I over my people. Right? I do homework for them. Yeah, I mean in short as well, I do the homework for them. Every morning I'm up by 4 30 a.m. Singapore time, 4 30 a.m. I'm up. Then I run through all the news and I'll be in front of CNBC, I'll be watching the news and I'll have to take down all the key notes uh, of the market and I'll prepare the notes and then I coin as MAO which stands for Market Analysis and Outlook Okay, and then by 8.30 it's really live I'll go on Facebook and then I go live and I'll tell them okay today what's the global market news what can you do with the market for gold today how should you buy what to look out for and stuff like that so I do that mm-hmm. every day, Monday to Friday, right? Mm-hmm. Even let's say, example, if I really can't make it by this certain time because I may have one personal thing to run, I will even record it early in the morning at 6 a.m. and put it up. Right. So that is the why probably if you have a person like me who's so crazy on my work, right? <laughs> okay, then maybe you are like, okay, I'll find this guy is there doing my homework, my so. So I think you are, that's why the, the $96 that they are paying is not only just indicator, they are also paying for my time and my effort for this way. Sure, sure. Mm. Okay, that's, that's, that's really um, exciting, especially, you know, maybe you really want to trail the so-called your subscriber who make that 5 to 10k per day. <laughs> so that, that, that really makes sense. I don't know, that, that sounds pretty exciting to be, you know, to be part of your, your, your this uh, gold club or gold fan. Mm, yeah, that right. we can be really on the ball to find out not just the gold price prices mm. but very much how can we benefit from this gold pricing yeah, and right. the fluctuation of the gold pricing you know amidst the market news you know the speculations or whatever they, they call the conspiracy you know towards um, between gold pricing that, that, that aspect mm. so we shouldn't be too much bothered with all the all the news that is not helping us to make money on the gold pricing, that's, that's what I thought. Oh, okay, yeah. what is really like, yeah. news is relative, all right, it's subjective too. It's end of the day is that if the news is created, but yeah, me put it this way, the mainstream media will have to report news, okay? But it's all how you decipher from it. Sure, all right, sure, the same of piece of information can have a buyer and a seller at the same time. Mm-hmm. But the more important thing is that, right, when the markets are to trade, you have to know whether the piece of news that you receive, right, is going to help you often to, uh, you know, give you a problem. Sure. Yeah. So that's why for us, for we, for us, so we will try to avoid news. In fact, mm. we look at the technical of the market. We look at the price action. We look at what the boys really are doing. Because my indicator is allowed, is able to track the boys. Now, of course, people may ask me, how do you guys track the boys then? Because the boys won't tell you what they do, right? Yeah. So what I did was that over the past few, past, in fact, past 20 years in this market, I realized that it's all about patterns. Okay. Patterns. Yeah. It's like human behavior patterns. Mm. It's like, you know, when traders trade, there's a very uh, recurring patterns that they always do. And what the system does, it extracted these patterns, mm. redo it into algorithm, and from external server, we are able to basically do a match. Meaning, right, when the market moves, right, this server will actually match the price action and see whether is this leaning towards the buy side or leaning to the sell side. And, and from there itself, right, the system will be able to use colors to tell you, okay, if it's green in color, that means the boys are buying. If it's red in color, the boys are selling. And that extra little unfair competitive edge. <laughs> okay, sure, okay. Alright, I've given our traders this reason why they can make money from the market. Now I would like to just be very upfront here. No system is 100 percent Alright, but any system that can yield you at a 78% to 80% uh, consistent with, uh, consistency in terms of uh, result, right? I think that is more important. Mm-hmm. But of course as a trader you also need to be disciplined you yeah. have your risk management control, all this will play a part. So that's why some people did ask me, 
Some people can make tens of thousands per day, but still some individual will still lose money, even though they are always using the same, same system. So I always joke on this, it's like, we go to school, we have 40 of us in the class, teacher teach the same thing, but seem to be there's always the first place <laughs> and the 40th place. Sure. So, so that is what I always try to, you know, tell people that, you know, that is how everybody interpret like, the same information. But, but it really sounds interesting that, you know, to look at your system, to really experience it by just looking at the colours to determine whether buy or sell and there's still a high good probability of, uh, you know, making some good strides for that day mm -hmm. and um, that is, that is um, intriguing uh, compared to, to looking at some other property indicators in the market. That, we, we try yeah. to make this thing easier. Now we stress on this thing called simple, mm -hmm. easy, consistent. Oh, right, okay. okay, simple enough by watching it. So colors are something that we can relate to. You're right, you cannot be wrong with colors. Right, red is red, yellow is yellow. It cannot be different. But when you draw trend lines, you have indicators that moves around. So usually that will cause confusion. So we want it to be as simple as it is. And you don't see our chart very confusing with lots of lines. In fact, we, our lines are pretty, we don't draw lines. In fact, we just see colors and we trick. So easy because why? Once you get the whole of the, the the steps to do, sure. we need to see this happening, just have to do this, that is easy to follow. So our younger students can be, you know, way, way much younger than the right way to trade because they are learning, okay? We have also really, very, what you call, uh, senior members. I think our mm -hmm. most senior members of 81 this year. Wow, 81. Yes, and he is really very on. In fact, he's still learning every day and he's always in one MAO, he's there to listen. I really give him my top most salute. Sure, sure. Mm. Me too. Okay. okay. Sounds, sounds really easy. Right? <laughs> so, uh, perhaps we'll look forward to, you know, um, gathering more information of how we can really participate to really, you know, get a piece of your systems and, and probably experience ourselves. Definitely. Um, definitely. Yeah, correct, correct. Okay, do watch out for our um, next sharing session pertaining to you know the price of the gold and silver soon. And remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Yeah, subscribe. Huh? Thank you. YouTube channel. Right? Okay. Thank so you, guys, Thank you for your time. Yeah.